Hello and welcome to a day in my life as a UN intern. I'm Anna May. If you're new, I'm running very late. Not actually late, it's that I need to be early. I'll explain that later. But I had lost my Metro card, but I found it, so it's all good. Um, I'm Anna May. I intern at UNHQ. Uh, I've been here since January. It's now May and I leave next month. So, with that kind of stuff covered, Let's get on subway. So I honestly have a pretty easy commute. It was like pouring rain this day. Um, but I just walked to the subway, get the subway, and then I walk from Grand Central to the UN, which is pretty good. And once I get there, I do have to go through security, which is kind of annoying. And you absolutely cannot film in there and you can't take out your phone or anything. So that's one side. This is the other side. Some of the statues inside. And I think I show all of the previous secretary generals. They all have these lovely tapestries in the entryway. So, good day, good morning. I made it to my desk. Um, the reason I was rushing so much is that I didn't realize I was put on a media stakeout. So when people are going in and out of the security council, they might make a statement and we got to deal with it fast and it starts earlier than other things so i gotta get in on time but yeah we're in the what's referred to the fish tank for us it's a, an old conference room but it's like basically a war table not the best analogy to use in the un but um yeah it's where the interns are and some uh, sometimes some uh contractors so yeah, maybe I'll explain my role at a different point, but it's a miserable day here. It's a day for ducks, honestly. Um, but yeah, just starting the day. So before anyone got there, I just kind of showed a little sneak peek of our setup in the room. So this is where all the interns are and some others. So it has turned into one of those days where I was very glad I was early because... Is he going to talk? No. Um fee didn't open so I had to call two different people because I called people who usually deal with this but because it's stakeout it's different um so I called them and then they were like no you should call the other people so then I called them and then they were like oh there's another event there's a big event on today uh for the new PGA like an open dialogue and they're like oh it has cart services now I was like which is like uh, live captioning so I had to schedule that because I'm the only one in the office but yeah that's my morning so far I'm all puffy it's great nobody's talking at stakeout I hope nobody does now that I say that lots of people are going to talk but yeah just waiting for everybody to get here we're getting a new intern on Wednesday apparently so that should be fun so depending on the schedule of the day, um, kind of depends on when I will grab lunch and I, on a day like today, I'm going to be doing it in the cafeteria. Uh, then I went back to my desk and I worked, honestly. Um, I am with the webcast unit, so what I'm probably doing here is fixing the metadata for videos that are going into the archive. So yeah, that's kind of my regular day. Um, I think today I was monitoring the ARIA formula meeting of the Security Council, which was pretty interesting, actually. Surprise! I'm back now. Uh, I didn't take out my phone after I like left the UN because it was honestly hazardous for the welfare of my phone because it is raining so much my let, let me just show you my Sperry so you can saturated disgusting disgusting so I'm just gonna have a snack right now it's weird that I'm not super hungry but I can't decide what I want at all I know I don't want like a big meal at all. I'm gonna have a snack and then another snack. <laughs> um, but I'm just gonna have hummus and crackers right now. Um, I'm gonna get a migraine. Hormones. 
Uh, but yeah, it's gonna get me good. So I'm gonna take stuff for that and generally chill out. Today was a pretty quiet day at work. I'm sure I explained that in those short little clips, but I also have to be super careful because A, it's the UN and you know, you also, I also don't have like, I don't wanna get too many people in it because I don't have their permission to film whatever. So yeah, also one of my 12 scrunchies I got off Amazon. Um, yeah, so hummus and cracker time. So I'm literally lying in bed right now, even though it is half eight. Uh, because A, I'm freezing. It's so freaking cold here right now. I can't. I don't do cold weather. Um, even though, yeah, I'm Irish. I can do rain and wind and all that sort of stuff. But, um... I hate when weather is unseasonal, more so than cold weather. Like, I don't like the winter, but I am fine with winter being cold. I'm not okay with May being cold, you feel me? Can of Diet Coke peep there in the back. Um, I have a migraine, so I'm getting a little confused every once in a while, um, which happens pretty often. But I had something to eat and then I also made cookies because I want to go also how cute is my nail polish um but yeah that is really all I'm going to be doing for the day I'm shopping at the J Crew factory sale because with the, the migraine I don't want to work out um usually I'd work out in the evenings but yeah it's a quiet day around here so I think just kind of like wrap up as you can probably tell if you made it to this part of the video as much as i really enjoy interning at the un it's not exactly the most exciting thing uh we should be getting a new intern in two days which could be really exciting a girl intern because the other intern that we had who i got along really well with uh he just left so there's currently two interns and then a contractor in our room. I get along really well with them, but uh, things are just really quiet at the minute. I'm kind of stuck in this weird limbo of like, feeling like I really need to take in every last minute I have here, but also just being so done. The whole like grad visa, I'm on the one year J1 grad visa. Um, that has been an issue since the beginning. And I'm going to be making a video kind of addressing that basically as soon as my contract is done with them because um, I just don't want to screw anything over while I'm still here. Yeah, because of that, you know, I had such difficulty up until mid-March that it was just harder to settle in in a lot of ways um, and it just made things a lot more difficult for me. So it's like I wish I was, I'm super excited to go home but I wish I was I wish I had a better time, if that makes sense. But my internship, thankfully, is great. Um, I have done a Q&A about interning at the UN and I have another video on just like random facts. Um, and I'm sure I'm gonna have to voice over a lot of this. So I should have given you more information in that way. But also a lot of internships at the UN are not quite as long as mine, mine's five months, that was the minimum I could do it for and honestly because of my visa I was looking for a really long term internship, yeah, I'm done in just over a month, which is crazy, um, but I've been here since January, so honestly it depends so much on the department that you're in, but for me, you know, my internship is basically, it's just a regular work day and it's really exciting to be in an organization like the United Nations and to get your start there and to make connections there and I think that's really important. So I'm really glad I've decided to do this but um, at the same time maybe it's not as thrilling as some people might think. Um, yeah, so that is it for this video. I'm gonna have to edit this <laughs> down so much, this last section, because I keep having brain farts because migraine. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe. As I said, I'm moving home, but I'm like just gonna be chilling, having fun for the summer, because I haven't done that in a while. So, um, and then I'm gonna be starting my master's. Obviously ending my grad visa early, um, but more on that later. 
follow me on Instagram at anime.yt because that's where I'm most active. Yeah, more UN related videos to come. I'm applying for like something kind of crazy. I would love if I got it and that would give me a lot of travel opportunities and hopefully I'd still be able to continue this. So that's always cool. But yeah, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in my next one.